In today's video, I'm gonna be explaining the truth about losing belly fat. I'm gonna be explaining how you go about this and debunking a lot of the myths and lies that they tell you online about this. If you're new to my channel, my name is Dan and I simplify losing fat and building muscle. Let's get into it. Let's address the elephant in the room. You cannot spot reduce body fat, meaning you cannot target specific areas of body fat. People talk about bingo wings, having flabby arms, a bit of belly fat around here. If you do exercises such as ab, work, ab workouts, or you try and you know swing your arm about here, you're not gonna lose specific regions of body fat. And genetics is primarily gonna determine where you store that body fat. Differences between genders on this and between individuals as well. So unfortunately, you've just gotta accept the hand you're dealt in terms of genetics and then maximize your own potential here. So don't get disheartened by where you're storing body fat because it will come off. It's just a matter of time and staying patient with it. The problem is people are just generally impatient. And this is why if you look on YouTube, some of the most searched videos or viewed videos that have like tens of millions of views say how to lose belly fat in one week, how to lose belly fat in two weeks. And the truth is people are misleading you here. If you see, if you see a video of how to lose belly fat in one week and the transformation is dramatic, there is no way that you can actually lose tons of belly fat in one week it's just not possible now what actually is going to get you results is creating a sustainable calorie deficit through lifestyle changes over time so what do i mean here calorie deficit means burning more calories than you are consuming so in practice what we need is to increase our activity levels through a step count getting in the gym training weight training two or three times per week doing some more steps, getting your step count up to say eight to 10K, maybe doing one cardio session a week, bringing that activity levels up slightly and then tapering down the amount of food you are eating. So the easiest way to do this is to uh, cut out snacks or reduce your carb portions and your fat portions slightly at each meal, increase that protein intake and then suddenly you're gonna look a lot more, a lot better in the mirror after a number of weeks and months people get a bit disheartened that it takes a good amount of time to see these changes and this is why people resort, resort to quick fixes looking for how to lose belly fat in one week two weeks instead of doing all this let's actually focus on the longer term and how you're going to get to a better place in the longer term rather than just looking for quick fixes to save yourself stress and time on getting that belly fat off Create the calorie deficit through your diet, fix the diet first and get more active through step count and a little bit of cardio and weight training. So doing those lifestyle changes is what's going to get the overall amount of, belly, of fat that you are have on your body down and then it will start to come off your belly. Now, how much ab workouts do you actually need to do? You do not need to be doing one hour ab workouts or 30 minute ab workouts. And while there's definitely some benefit to doing home workouts, and I'm not against that at all, they're obviously beneficial during lockdown. The thing is, you, you, it's such a small muscle group as part of your overall physique, that if you spend an hour on an ab workout, you're targeting such a small region in the body in terms of overall muscle muscular development, that that time would be better spent doing a full body workout hitting multiple muscle groups so if you are someone that only has two or three hours per week to train you can't really afford to spend one hour of that looking at just your abs so instead i would just implement a full body workout routine which hits multiple muscle groups through a squat or a leg press some form of chest press shoulder press a, a rowing motion for your back and a pull down or a pull up and then some supplementary exercises as well, such as a hamstring curl, bicep curl, triceps, uh, calves if you want as well. Now, once you've got and a deadlift variation as well. Now, I luckily for you, I have a free training program that you can follow that has all of these exercises in to make the maximum amount of change to your body with the least amount of time spent in the gym. And I have a full video breaking down this workout routine, time efficient workout routine as well. So if you would like that, just drop me a DM on Instagram or shoot me an email, links are in the video description and I'll send those over to you. Now, the time efficient workouts that I've assembled that are full body are gonna give you the, the biggest bang for your buck. So instead of spending an hour doing just abs, pick one or two exercises and tag them on the end of a better workout routine. Once you're adding weight to your ab exercises over time, that muscle group is going to grow as well. 
just like any other muscle group will. So instead of doing 30 reps, 40 reps of body weight ab exercises, start adding weight, progressing the weights over time like you would with any other muscle group and just pick one or two good exercises to start with for abs, add them on at the end of these full body workouts and prioritizing diet side of things to actually lose the belly fat is then going to make your abs look more visible. So without having lost the, the fat surrounding that area in the first place, your abs won't be visible anyway. So you could spend hours and hours doing your ab workouts to no avail if you can't actually see because of a layer of fat covering that region. If you found the video useful, please do drop it a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new so that we can reach other people out there and help them as well. If you would like to take your results to the next level, I offer online coaching services as well. I would love to get you amazing results. You can see my client results on my website and Instagram page linked in the video description and you can apply through that for coaching as well. So book a free call with me, drop me a message if you are interested. Have a great rest of your day and I'll see you on the next video. Thank you very much. See you later. Bye.